Hello there, YouTube. Once again, this is Fragments of Memory. Now, I've been looking at some YouTube videos dealing with the whole True Force Lonely movement, also known as TFL. Now, the TFL movement talks about how many are forced into loneliness. They're put on the fringes of the dating scene in society because of not having the right looks or the right amount of money or the right amount of social skills or whatever the case might be something keeps them forced out of the dating mating scene now when i heard about this i think it was just a random youtube video and then i i found out later on or just tonight that there is a movement now as far as as far as that goes i do think there is validity to what is being said and the reason i say that is we are superficial we as human beings are superficial. We do judge things by looks and we judge things by financial situation. Now, yes, granted, a man should be someone that, especially men, men are affected by this. And I think that we as men should be hard workers. We as men should not be sitting on the couch just expecting for someone else to take care of us. However, I do think just like that CeeLo song, you know, the, the CeeLo song that's real popular right now, that the, it rhymes with duck. And there's you and you it begins with an f and you know what i'm talking about but anyway that CeeLo song the whole song he talks about how he wants to get with this one girl but the, he doesn't have enough money for her you know he's the dude that she goes for has more money he says i guess you're an x you know i guess he's an xbox and i'm more an atari you know i'm like a jeep and he's a ferrari or whatever the case might be so this woman that he was really into and would have done anything for it to please, she only, she didn't want him unless he had the right financial situation. And also appearances do matter, unfortunately. We judge by appearances. I mean, yes, personality is very important. However, people don't judge by personality initially. We judge by looks, we judge by financial situation. Oh, he ain't got his own car. Um, I don't want to touch, catch the bus. Um, Chris Rock even made a statement about how women don't like to go back in lifestyle. Where once a woman met a dude with a car, she wasn't going to mess with no dudes that didn't have no car. If a woman messed with a dude that had his own place. And of course, I'm not saying that any of these things are bad per se, but economic situations happen, educational situations happen, things happen to people where they may not have those wonderful things. Or let's say I had those things and then lose them. Are you going to dip on me because I lost them? You know, so, but then we're, t we're told to see the inside of a person. And if a man were to judge a woman on the size of her breasts or the size of her behind, men would be seen as, men are seen as shallow, superficial pigs. But if a woman does it, She's looking out for her investment, i.e. her future, and on and on and on. So even right now, there's this album by Carrie Hilson, and she's talking about how no boys allowed. And apparently, she, I, I've suffered through this 106 in Park interview about how, you know, I'm tired of dealing with little boys. I want a man. I want a real man. A real man got his own stuff. A real man got his this. A real man do this. So if the brother fell on some hard economic times and couldn't find work, he ain't a real man. Or if the brother did this, he, he just, he just, he just, quote unquote, excuse my language, ass out. And again, so I can see where these TFL people are coming from. I think they got, they make a good point that we, I think women try to sell themselves as these wonderful beings of light. And there are women that are, but Women, a woman can be just as superficial and, and shallow as a man. Whether it's appearance, financial situation, vehicular situation, whatever the case might be, living situation. And there are many to get forced out. I mean, there are many to get forced out. Now, I saw the video of a gentleman. He was a, he was a little bit on the larger side, and he was talking about how he has social skills, you know, he has the skills to talk to another human being. This is no problem. He doesn't need a pickup artist routine. He just needed to, you know, but he just recognized that even though he might be well versed and well spoken and professional, that due to his appearance, due to him being a slightly larger brother, you know, he's not getting no love because women are superficial. 
women want to go for the dude that may look like this instead of what he looked like or what, you know. Like, I'm a pretty skinny dude sometimes. You know, I've noticed where ladies don't really go for skinny guys. They like them big muscular dudes. So I'm kind of over here like, okay, <laughs> you know. So I, I can I can empathize and sympathize with that to a certain degree. In, in high school, I was seen as sort of a nerd. I mean, people went as far to call me gay. You know, I was scared of women. But... Uh, just nobody was really feeling me back then, so I I can I can sympathize with that. I think these TFLers are on to something. Um, what else to say? Just an interesting movement. Just that men in general are forced out. I mean, there are women that are not seen as appealing and are forced out too. But I think it does affect men more because the man is naturally expected to be the chaser, the hunter. You know. And in our honesty, it's the woman that chooses the man, not the other way around. The man doesn't choose the woman. The woman chooses the man. Um, the comedian Chris Rock even talked about that. And again, I'm referencing Chris Rock. Chris Rock talked about how the man, you know, the woman, the woman in the first few minutes or first few moments of meeting a man has already decided whether or not she's going to give him some play, as he put it. So... With that being the case, if I don't measure up to your standards in that first few minutes, I'm done. I'm cooked. <laughs> you know, I'm done. I might as well just hang it up and go home and ride off into the sunset because you've already made a decision about me in the first few minutes of meeting me. Wow. That is kind of superficial. Let's keep it real, ladies. And I'm not anti-woman. I'm not anti-female. But I understand that don't sell us on the whole women are these pure beings of light and men are these dogs when that's not necessarily true. Well, folks, I do want to just say thank you. Thank you so much for at least tuning into this video. And um, any TFLers, y'all got something good going on here. I think y'all own this something personally, but that's just how I view it. Well, peace and once again, thanks for at least um, putting your info out there. Your movement sounds fascinating. I haven't been to the website, so y'all should go to their website. It's an interesting, uh, interesting thing, whether you agree or disagree or indifferent. Just get some, get some perspective on this. This is pretty neat, so take care.